Well, let me ask you a question. Have you ever ridden an elephant? Well, for a lot of people, when they go away on holidays, it's on the to-do list. Well, today I'm joined by a special guest, actress Susie Porter. She's an ambassador for World Animal Protection and she's here to share why she's giving elephant rides a miss on her next holiday. And let me tell you, it may make you rethink your elephant ride as well. Hi, Susie. Hi, Karen. And you're right, elephant rides have been a must for so many travellers and families on holiday. But what most of us aren't even aware of is the hidden cruelty and the suffering that these elephants experience behind the scenes. Yeah, I mean, an elephant ride for most of us sounds like a whole lot of fun. Yeah, it does. But I was so saddened to learn about the cruelty that these poor elephants face. Mm. A baby elephant living free in the wild with the comfort of her mother is suddenly snatched from her family and placed in captivity. She's beaten with bamboo sticks studded with nails, being starved, deprived of sleep for up to a week. And she's tortured like this to crush her spirit and make her submit to carrying tourists on her back. Gee, I mean, I had no idea that an elephant goes through that kind of pain and suffering just so we tourists can have an elephant ride. Look, I understand your shock and it's so upsetting to think of an elephant treated like this. Mm. But sadly, this is the cruel and lonely life that is the reality for so many elephants in the tourism industry. Mm. You see, elephants weren't meant for riding people around on their backs. They weren't meant for a life of chains and isolation from their families. So true. I mean, this life is so different from the one that they really should be living in the wild. That's exactly right. And this is why it's so distressing to see. We know that in the wild... Elephants are highly social and enjoy living with strong family units of up to 20 other elephants. Mm. But instead, these working elephants live apart from their close-knit family and all to carry the weight of unknowing tourists on their back for nine hours a day, seven days a week for the duration of their lives. Mm. And the worst part is, if they're too exhausted or stressed to perform, they're punished into submission. That is just shocking. I mean, it's really hard to believe that this is happening right now. I mean, if you hadn't told me, I'd never have known that such cruelty to elephants was going on in the background. Well, you're not alone there, Karen, but thankfully we can all help protect these magnificent creatures from this cruelty. By donating today, you can help keep wild animals in the wild where they belong. Yeah, and donating is so easy. All you need to do is visit stampoutheabuse.org.au. But Susie, what can our donations do? The support of people like you is so important to help World Animal Protection's work to reduce demand for elephant rides by revealing this cruelty behind the scenes. Look, it could also help them work with the tourist industry and governments to develop the animal-friendly practices and laws and could help protect elephants currently in captivity from further cruelty. Yeah, World Animal Protection have had a lot of wins over the last 50 years, haven't they? They sure have, and that's why I'm an ambassador of theirs. And thanks to the generous supporters, they've protected countless animals around the world from terrible cruelty. And now they're working to help keep wild animals like elephants in the wild where they belong. Yeah, it would be great to add ending the hidden cruelty behind elephant rides to the long list of wins. Yeah, exactly. And cruelty to elephants in particular is so heartbreaking to me because elephants never forget. Mm. They remember the pain and suffering for the rest of their lives. They remember the bamboo sticks with nails. They remember being torn from their mothers, the chains and the confinement. They desperately need us to help protect them from the hidden cruelty and trauma. So please join me in protecting elephants and other animals around the world by donating today. Visit stampoutheabuse.org.au or call 1300 308 470 now. Yeah, the details are also on screen below. Susie, thank you so much for coming in. Such an important message. Well, thanks for having me, Karen, and please help. Um, stamp out cruelty of elephant rides. Yeah, such a great message and something that is so powerful. Call the number or get onto the website now.